An 82-year-old Chinese scientist, Huang Ling Yi, set a formidable challenge for American scientists. For innovation, the lungs and chips disrupted the U.S. monopoly, saving China trillions of dollars. This breakthrough not only made China self-sufficient in this domain, but positioned it as a major competitor to the U.S. in chip exports. Once reliant on U.S. chips, China has now emerged as a major exporter. What exactly are lungs and chips, and how have they revolutionized the chip industry for China? Let's delve deeper. Hello and welcome back to Innovative Czech YouTube channel, where we delve into the innovative and transformative projects changing our world. You're new to the channel and enjoy learning about innovation stories around the world. You've come to the right place. Please subscribe, like, and comment to help boost our videos on YouTube. Today, we'll uncover how Huang Lingye's efforts undermined the U.S. monopoly and explore the significance of these chips to China. Stay with us until the end to find out if the U.S. might soon be clamoring for these Chinese innovations. In today's technological race, Huang Lingye's groundbreaking work stands out. At 82, she has not only created China's proprietary lungs and chip, but also disrupted the U.S. technological hegemony. Prior to this invention, China's reliance on American-made chips made them susceptible to foreign influence and control. This breakthrough, however, not only shattered the U.S. monopoly, but also spotlighted China's chip industry on the global stage. Previously, lung son chips were solely produced by the U.S. and were in high demand globally. The advent of the lung son chip marked a pivotal moment, boosting China's self-reliance in microprocessors. This strategic move not only undercut the U.S., dominance but saved China trillions by offering a local alternative to U.S. chips. The economic implications of this shift have been profound, bolstering China's financial stability in the tech domain. U.S. tech giants suddenly found themselves facing stiff competition, with some international firms feeling overshadowed by the rise of Chinese chips. Beyond challenging the U.S., the lungs and chips design also posed a threat to tech behemoths like ARM and Intel. So, what makes lungs on chips so special? These chips belong to a versatile family of MIPS architecture-compatible microprocessors. Breaking away from ARM and Intel's dominance, the company behind the lungs and chips, Longson Technology, has been pivotal in this transformative journey. Born from a collaboration between the Institute of Computing Technology and Beijing-based Blackstick Design Corporation, Longson Technology exemplifies the synergy of public and private sectors. However, how did the U.S. originally corner the lungs and chip market? Before delving deeper, we'd love to know your thoughts. Are you finding this exploration engaging? If so, please consider liking, sharing, and subscribing to our channel for a deeper dive into China's technological strides. Tracing back, the Lung Zan journey began in 2005 with the development of its first-generation processors. These foundational chips paved the way for advanced versions, like the Lung Zan E, enhancing their versatility and performance. In academic circles, they're also revered as gods and processors, underscoring their importance. Huang Lingye's pioneering efforts have irrefutably reshaped China's tech landscape. By confronting and breaking the American technology monopoly, and by positioning China at the forefront of the microprocessor industry, the Longzhen chip has elevated China's domestic tech industry to unprecedented levels. Interestingly, these chips alone accounted for a whopping $600 trillion in savings for China, and if you believe that was the sole financial benefit, think again. You are enjoying this video so far. Please don't forget to subscribe, share the video, and comment. Previously, China's dependency on importing these chips from the U.S. was vast. But with escalating sanctions and the looming threat of chip scarcity, it became imperative for China to devise a contingency. Their answer was clear commence domestic chip production to ensure uninterrupted supply. This pursuit of technological autonomy led to pioneering feats in chip manufacturing, progressing from 28 nanometer chips and beyond. Yet the Longsan chip, with its intricate design and prohibitive cost imposed by the U.S. remained elusive. As the geopolitical tussle between the U.S. and China intensified, America attempted to limit China's reach to frontier tech, especially microchips. To compound the challenge, the U.S. tagged these indispensable chips with exorbitant prices, making it economically daunting for China. In this backdrop of technological uncertainty, Huang Lingye's resilience shone. With unwavering focus, she embarked on a singular mission, create the lungs and chips domestically, devoid of external reliance. Her journey, fraught with intense research, rigorous experimentation, and the challenges of pioneering, 
soon became a beacon of China's indomitable spirit. Despite the arduous path and inevitable setbacks, Huang Ling Yi's tenacity never wavered. Through iterative refinement and innovation, she achieved what many deemed impossible, producing Longsun chips without foreign aid. This watershed moment in China's tech evolution signaled its fierce determination to achieve self-sustainability in microchip production. Huang Lingyi's endeavor is a testament to China's unwavering commitment to technological independence. This newly acquired capability to produce chips domestically offers China a strategic advantage across sectors, from electronics to telecommunications. China's drive to extricate itself from foreign technological shackles signifies a monumental step towards its futuristic vision in an ever-evolving world. Her legacy will indelibly inspire future scientists and engineers to push the envelope and contribute to China's ascent as a technological titan. With its newfound prowess in semiconductor production, China now eyes the global market, challenging traditional chip exporters like the U.S. The implications are manifold. With competitive pricing and quality, China's chips may soon draw global customers, nudging U.S. manufacturers to innovate more aggressively. If China consolidates its position as a dominant semiconductor exporter to the U.S., it could potentially influence trade dynamics. China's march towards semiconductor self-reliance and its ambitions on the global stage herald significant shifts in the tech realm. While opportunities abound for China, challenges loom for the U.S. and other established players. It is often said that true legends never die. They live on through the legacy they leave behind. In the case of Ling Huang, her legacy is vast and profound. It's not just the chips or the technological advancements, but the spirit of relentless pursuit in the face of adversity. The journey of China in the chip industry mirrors the journey of Ling Huang. Starting from a position of dependence, facing challenges, and ultimately achieving autonomy, her relentless spirit epitomized the national sentiment of rising against external pressures and achieving self-sufficiency. Her tenacity and deep sense of responsibility towards her nation's growth and security have laid a foundation upon which the future of China's chip industry will be built. The void left by her passing is palpable, and the Chinese integrated circuit industry will feel her absence keenly. Yet the momentum she provided will continue to drive the industry forward. Her legacy will serve as a rallying cry for young engineers, researchers, and professionals to continue the journey she so passionately began. While the global chip market is undeniably competitive, the legacy of Ling Yi Huang assures that China has a foothold in this industry, and with the same grit and determination, it can continue to ascend to new heights as China continues its journey in the chip domain. The spirit of Ling Yi Huang will be an enduring source of inspiration, reminding every individual of the power of dedication and the importance of serving a greater good. Ling Yi Huang's story is not just a tale of technological progress, but a testament to human spirit, determination, and love for one's country. It serves as a poignant reminder of the significant strides China has made and the heights it can achieve with the unwavering spirit of its people. In honoring her, we celebrate not only her achievements, but also the spirit of innovation, dedication, and national pride. Future generations will undoubtedly look back at her life and work as a beacon of inspiration, a guiding light in their own quest to push boundaries and serve their nation. Thank you for your attention, and I welcome your thoughts and questions on this complex and vital subject. Do you want to watch more videos like this one? If yes, please like and share the video and subscribe to get exclusive videos about how phenomenally China is developing and growing its influence. Your subscriptions and likes motivate us to generate more content, so please keep supporting us. Check out this video showing on your screen right now, and I will see you on the other side.